artists who are painting those wildly popular Padres murals are now working on a new figure. Legendary Mexican singer Vicente Fernandez died over the weekend. Our ABC 10 News reporter Leah Pizzetti shows why this painting is personal for them. Their paintings can be found across San Diego. This is where the art show is going to be. Couple Paul and Zena have created some iconic murals around town. It always feels really good to be able to put somebody on the wall that you know the community is really going to get behind. People like Fernando Tatis Jr., Joe Musgrove, and now. This is Vicente Fernandez, and uh, he is an absolute legend. The duo had talked about painting the iconic Mexican singer for the last year. Those plans changed this last weekend. I was expecting to paint him, and I was hoping that he'd be able to see it. But unfortunately, you know, he's passed away. So now it's a memorial of a man they say was a staple in their culture and homes. Vicente Fernandez is who the whole family's bumping at all the parties. When I hear him now, I, I can, it brings me back to nostalgic memories of just being a kid and being with my family and my, especially my grandma. My grandma had the biggest crush on him. They say creating this mural was effortless. It came really naturally, right from the heart. An ode to a legend now lost. And I, and I was just playing his music in my head the whole time. It, it was, it was a, it, it really felt good to be able to pay my respects this way. Paying respects in a way that everyone can now enjoy, keeping this icon's presence alive in San Diego through art. Leah Pizzetti, ABC 10 News. And they did a remarkable job. That looks fantastic. You can check on the, at the uh, Vicente Fernandez mural on Imperial Avenue near 25th Street in Sherman Heights.